Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I'm going to be doing a both hands challenge video. So basically I'm just going to be using both of my hands to put on my makeup. If you're interested in seeing me struggle with that one, then please keep on watching. Okay, so the first thing is pretty easy. I'm going to start with primer. This is the NYX Photo Loving Primer. I usually use both my hands anyway, so this should be quite easy. Okay, so that was pretty easy. I'm just going to zoom you in a little bit just so you can see better. Now I'm going in with the foundation and I'm using my Krylon TV paint stick and I'm in the shade G02. I don't really know how to do this with both hands so I'm just going to do the blending with both hands. Okay, time to blend that in. I mean, it's efficient. It's kind of hard to tell what you're doing. <laughs> like, how am I supposed to see what's happening? Okay, I'd say that was successful. Let's move on to concealer. Okay, so I don't really have um, a concealer, like two of the same concealer brush. So I'm also going to be using this one. They're kind of similar. Um, to apply the concealer. And I am using my Kevin Aquan Sensual Skin Enhancer in the shade SX07. I just swapped the brushes over because I picked up more product on one, the other, on one than the other. So that was a lot harder than it looked. Now I'm going to blend it in. Um, going back to those sponges. This hand is not bouncing as well as this one, and it's a struggle. So I think that's going to have to do, so I'm moving on to powder now, using my Face of Australia Translucent Loose Powder. So I'm going back into the sponges, and I'm dipping them in the powder. This is for under the eyes. Okay, um, then I'm gonna move on to powdering the whole face. I think I'll just switch to a brush just to mix everything up. Okay, so now I'm gonna set the face using brushes. This one's a little bit smaller than the other one, so I'm gonna switch them and use the smaller one with my dominant hand and the larger brush with my left hand. When you get that I'm outside text, So now moving on to the eyebrows. I'm using this spoolie from a pencil and also one of these things to brush out the foundation. And because I've only got one of this pencil in this color, I'm going to be using my Anastasia Brow Powder in the shade Ebony and I'm going in with um, these angled brushes. This is really hard because one eyebrow... What? Yeah, this is actually pretty hard because um, one eyebrow needs more filling than the other, so... Like, what's this one supposed to do while I fill this one in, you know? That'll have to do. Let's bully them. That sounded like I said, let's bully them. Don't bully your eyebrows. I think I'm going to finish off the rest of the face and then come to the eyes because I feel like the eyes will be a little bit harder. Now I'm going to do bronzer and I'm using this Milani baked bronzer in the shade Soleil and these brushes. And once again, I'm going to be using the more larger 
denser kind of one on this side just because I'm more control with my right hand and the other one on the left side. I think with this challenge the face stuff is generally not too bad. It's only when it comes to doing smaller like detailed things that it becomes a little bit harder. Now I'm going to be moving on to contour and I'm using my Shade and Light palette. Contour, contour palette? Contour. Contour. And I'm going to be using these brushes. Now they look kind of similar but this one's a little bit more like flat and tapered this way. As you can tell this was a little bit more round. So I'm going to be dipping in to this shade and this one, so these two here, and contouring my cheekbones. Hmm, not bad. I'm going to move on to blush now. And I'm using a blush in this Too Faced palette, um, just because it's got a nice peachy colour. It's called Peach Cobbler. And I'm using these brushes. And so for highlight, I'm using my Mary Luminizer and these brushes. I'm gonna move on to the eyes and I'm gonna stick to something pretty simple. I'm gonna use my Meet Matte Nude palette. I'm gonna take this shade, matte sing all over the eyelid. I'm using these brushes. One's shorter than the other, but they're like similar in um, density, so. Okay, then I'm taking these two brushes. I'm going into this shade right here. So I'm just putting this in the crease. I'm keeping this step simple as well. Oh my god. I am so uncoordinated. I think I want to challenge myself a little bit more and I'm going to put a shimmery shade um, on the eyelid and I'm going to go back into that. Too Faced palette that, I, that we used the blush for and I'm going to use this shade up here called Eggnog Latte and I'm taking these brushes I'm just going to take my fingers and um, try and blend that out because that didn't go very well Okay so now we're going to move on to the eyeliner Got my eyeliners here It's pretty good. Time for mascara. I've got two lash curlers here. I'm going to try not to rip out my eyelashes. I'm actually really impressed with that eyeliner. Like, come through Kat Von D. I'm like not really getting the lashes with this side. Mascara time. I've got um, one of those like mini sample ones, and they're both the better than sex mascara. So, if I can do this well, I'm gonna start doing it every day. Oh my god, this is amazing! I'm gonna use these two brushes, they're kind of similar, and I'm going back into that same shade that we used in the crease, the matte rosin. I'm just um, putting that. On the 
bottom lash line. Okay, so I'm going back to the mascara now. Now I'm moving on to lipstick. But I don't know how I'm going to do this with two hands. I'm just going to take um, a brush and the applicator. Not bad at all. I think since we've, since we've made it this far, I'm going to try and put on false lashes as well. So for lashes, I'm using Ardell Wispies. These are just out of their packaging, so I'm just going to put, a, um, put the glue on them, wait for them to become tacky, and then put both of them on at the same time. I'm going to hold them from the middle. Even holding them is hard, so I don't know how I'm going to put them on. Are you not impressed? That was amazing. Well, there you guys go. That was me doing the both hands makeup challenge. Um, I think it turned out really good. Like, to be honest, I don't think I'll ever glow on my eyeliner that even. Like, I'll zoom you in. Honestly, like it could use a little bit of work but look at the lashes, even the lips, like, it's a little and even here, but, you know, I think overall, it looks really good. So what I've learned from this challenge is if you do both of your eyeliners at the same time, they'll turn out even. Anyway, so I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Give this video a big thumbs up for me if you enjoyed watching and leave a comment down below letting me know what you thought. And so yeah, I'll see you guys in next week's video. Bye.